Howdy, and welcome to Howdy Island Gaming. Welcome to part 14 of The Last of Us, one of my favourite games of all time, to be honest. It's fantastic. It, that sounds like I'm being sarcastic, but that's just the British tone. How are you all? You guys are alright? I haven't played this in about a week and a half, I think it's been now. Um, I had to watch the last part a little bit just so I can remember what's happening. Um, I can't make that jump. Yeah. Well. If you get me up there, I can move that plank. Let's go get that. Right, well, um... Yeah, it's been good. I've, what I've been doing, if you've been wondering... Wait here! Let's see where this goes. I'm gonna go grab that plank, I think. Um... This place has been run quite well, I think. <laughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> Doing this backwards isn't a good idea. Yeah, I've been away in Lisbon. Uh, what is that all about? Get on. We're coming to the hotel. Let's see if I can do this. Um, okay. Yeah, um, sorry. I'm just trying to focus on getting this done and then. Nearly that, nearly that. And then I will talk. Got that plague like they did. Let's just quickly see what's in here. Yeah, I've been away in Lisbon for a couple of weeks. Oh, we are actually meant to go this way. Yeah, I think I figured it out. But I'm going to have a quick gander. Uh, yeah, I've been away in Lisbon. I was filming a commercial. I don't know if you guys... I'm sure you definitely do. Um, have me on my uh, YouTube channel. Um, I will be releasing a video. Oh, this place stinks. Yeah, words all run. I will be <laughs> releasing a video. Sort of. a lot? I did. All the time. And what would you get? Just... Just coffee. You'd get booze, you mess. <laughs> uh, yeah, I went to Lisbon. I filmed a commercial there. I sort of uh, took quite a few photos and stuff like that and um, filmed a little bit of it. Obviously, I couldn't bring my um, camera into where they were actually filming. But it was, oh my God, it was amazing. Like the uh, set that they'd sorted out. I mean, it was this humongous studio. Um, and they had fake snow and stuff like that. It was amazing. It was really, really nice. Let's see if I'm actually supposed to go up. I'm sure I am, but but um yeah, it was like absolutely astonishing the amount of stuff that they had uh, made for it. Did I just drop my brick? Oh no, yes I did. Oh, I got to pick that up. Got to always have a trusty brick. Uh, I think there's only been one part where I haven't had a brick. Stash notes. It goes down the night. We're gonna take the Eastern checkpoint. I'll stash some extra supplies at the Regal Apartments. It's marked with red X. All right, so we've got to keep an eye out for the red X. Cause that's where we're gonna get some extra equipment. Yeah, it was amazing. They had fake snow and, um, which I think was mainly like paste and uh, like paper choppings. But because there was so much of it, it slowly became toxic. I mean, I had like, there was Oh, and also, oh, I forgot to mention this, um, it was 20 degrees in Lisbon, uh, but obviously because it was supposed to be, it's a Christmas commercial, um, we were supposed to be dressed as if it was winter, so while it's 20 degrees, I'm wearing like a t-shirt, a jumper, a scarf, a jacket, um, uh, a hat, a scarf, so I was, I was absolutely drenched in sweat. Um, and a studio is always a little bit more hot than um, sort of outside because the amount of studio lights and stuff like that, that tends to warm up the place quite a lot. And um, there was like people like sort of fainting, there were kids a little bit crying a little, you know, we, you know, like they were doing the best they can uh, despite the situation. But um, yeah, it was crazy. But um, also the 
amount of snow. Just clear early. Make, well, Come on down. Snow. Oh, fancy. Uh, you ever seen it uh, before? It all went to shit. I mean. Um. Oh, hold on. There's a talkie point here. Oh, I really miss coffee. No, it's too high. Let's see what we can find. Uh, oh, I've just cut that off, haven't I? Um, yeah. So it was like a little bit toxic, and it's always it's always quite concerning when the crew are wearing um, protective masks that are usually associated with the SARS epidemic. Uh, so that was a bit alarming, and uh, yeah, it wasn't great. That was that that wasn't great. But I, you know, I was like sneezing and stuff like that. But um, yeah, and I had to speak Portuguese. Speak Portuguese. I'll see if I can bring it up on my phone what I said. Uh, hold on. I don't want to like stop playing just to find it. Uh, the, the, I'll, I'll see if I can say it in the video. Yeah. So keep an eye out on my channel and I'll just um, I'll say it there. I think it was uh, Noah Clitty uh, Two, which is uh, said badly. What are you doing? You are a weird kid. Don't oh, need combination. Okay. Uh, yeah, now it's ready to, which is uh, Portuguese for I don't believe it. I believe. Um, now it's ready to. Ah, God. What is it? Ah, hold on. Hamis uh, Televisão. I think, which means um, has it got television? So yeah. So let's see if I can say it at the same time. No equality to Hamis Televisão. And hopefully I haven't offended any of the uh, Portuguese viewers. Where am I going? Sorry, it's just turned into a podcast. All right, I think it's this way. Is it this way? No. All right, hold on. No, oh, no, it's here. Hey, there's a ladder back here. Where? 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 Where are you? Great. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Now that I've sp spoken Portuguese, I think we can move on to the next part of the level. Okay. Actually, I can just grab the ladder because I don't think this is going to be any help. All right. I think it's that. All right. We'll grab the ladder. But um, yeah. You know, it was really good fun. Really, really good fun. And I'm genuinely pleased with how it all went. Oh no, for fuck's sake. Sorry, I'm not with it. I'm not with it. It's been a long day. <laughs> right, up we go. I mean, seeing as in, in the last part, it was just a massacre. I think it's nice to have a little bit of, of a pace drop. <laughs> so yeah, Lisbon was amazing. I didn't get to see much of Watch it because we ran over... So, um run over time so I didn't get to see I didn't get to go out and properly see Lisbon but I think it just means that the money that I earn is just going to be spent going back to Lisbon oh shit get down get down how many is there now five just this week hey I'm not complaining I bet you not we done here we got on the floor to check man check for what I ain't seen a clicker in weeks that's because we're thorough. We're going to keep being thorough. Let's wrap this up, right? All right, whatever. Jeez. Oh. I, can't, I, f I must have broken the arrow inside of his face. Oh, mate, you scared the shit out of me. Um, but yeah, Lisbon was fantastic. I, I, um, I really want to go back there. Um, I didn't really get to, tr you know, have any of the delicacies or anything like that. Anything that um, they're famous for. What exactly is Lisbon famous for, uh, food-wise? I mean, the architecture is amazing. I mean, it also, I found that quite a lot of the people that I was working with were really into architecture. Like, really into architecture.
On that. Oh, Sean, you're an idiot. I don't need to do this. <laughs> but I wanted to. <laughs> oh, God. The kills in this feel really good. Like, really good. Uh, but yeah, I look forward to going back to Lisbon. It's amazing there. And also, you know, sort of like you have a bit of anxiety about flying and stuff like that. But even that was quite nice. I, I quite enjoyed the flight. I mean, I wasn't in first class at all. I was um, stuck between... Um, well, the first time around, I was stuck with uh, a large Portuguese man who was lovely. And he kept on smiling at me and stuff like that. Um, which sounds more ominous now that I've said that. Uh, but he was nice, and uh, next time around I was just near a, a woman who just really wanted to go to sleep, and I'm totally fine with that. Um, so I just sort of cranked down my boombox a little bit more than I usually would. <laughs> so, yeah, it was good though. I enjoyed it. I'm going to take that instead. I quite prefer a baseball bat to a bit of wood. So, yeah, let me just quickly make sure if I can make everything... Uh, Melee upgrade, let's do that. Let's upgrade the melee weapon. We've got three hey. shivs already. Yeah, give me a second, mate. Got that. And... Let's make another bomb. Okay, great. So now that when we go and pick things up, we um, won't be told it's full, and we can just keep going. All right. How's things? Okay. Right. Have we just gone around? No, we haven't. They just all look kind of similar. Okay, nothing in here. Oh god, we gotta look for the red X, don't we? we gotta make sure that we can find the red X. Nothing here. Surely there must be something here if they're just gonna give a random window. Oh, oh, there we go. Shh. Just like, I, I feel as if I've missed out on something, you know? I feel as if, oh, maybe I should have looked in this, or like, killed those other people. And, you know, you just never know. Also, he must have the greatest glutes. Because I just walk around like this, like a crab. Okay. In the game, I, I, I don't think I have the strength to constantly do this. Oh, man. Oh, that's creepy. Oh, take that. Okay, that's fucking sad as shit. But that's probably what you'd see quite a lot, wouldn't it? If, like, you know, this sort of thing's happened. It's very difficult to maintain hope for humanity. Hope for humanity! What if you go? I've got hope for humanity! Right. You know what? I'm gonna walk around like this. I don't think there's gonna be anyone that I have to worry about. No, not by the looks of it anyway. Oh! Yeah. Drop that one. What would you guys do in a situation like this? What would be like, I mean, like, you know, I'm not talking about zombie apocalypse, I'm talking about after, you know, so like, you know, after you've been to Costco and stolen as much shit as you can. I'm talking like, you know, after that and sort of five, ten years down the line. What's the goal? Uh -oh. Yeah, I hear it too. No, I didn't want to throw that. Oh, bollocks, I was looking for this. Fuck. Idiot. Ha <laughs> ha! 
Okay. He's dealt with. Shitting idiot. Can't believe I did that. Oh fuck! Fuck! Oh, for God's sake, Sean! Oh man! Brilliant. Palm, fucking face palm. Holy shit! Can I fuck that up more? No, I cannot. <laughs> oh lordy, that was one big old fuck up after another. <laughs> fucking idiot. I was doing so well as well. I can't believe I did that. Fuck's sake. Just one day I will do this simply. Oh no! Yeah, I reckon he was. Okay. Fuck's sake. I'm all sweaty now. I'm all sweaty just. Oh shit! What's right. You got, man? Fuck. Ow. Oh, fucking hell! This has been an absolute balls up. I can't believe I'm, I'm doing this on normal as well. So like, imagine if I was He's got a shotgun. Doing, on, doing this on a more difficult fucking. All right, just. I'm like annoyed at myself. Check out this thing. Go check over that one. Shit. No, wrong button. Just balls up around Jesus Christ. Biggest balls up. I think that was the worst sort of combination of plays that I have ever done. Obviously, I did the simple things of like sort of like making sure I can shoot around the corner, get this guy's guts hanging out and stuff like that. But I mean, come on, Sean. Jesus. I'm annoyed at myself. I'm annoyed at myself. What have I just thrown? Ah, oh, just for. Fuck. How many are there? Jesus Christ, I can't believe I did that as well. That's got to be all of them. That's got to be all of them. I can't believe I... God. You... I mean... I did get rid of him, but that's besides the point. I did it awfully. Okay. Well, he's dead now. Okay? That's all that matters. Jesus Christ. And also, somebody's just asked me. I've just looked at my phone. Somebody's just asked me if I can, um, if I count as a sort of work person to um, help them apply for a US visa. It's like, no, no, of course I don't count exactly. You work for me for free. <laughs> 
Is this... Uh, I can't believe I did that. Alright, we'll just keep searching for the apartments now. Now that there's nobody left. Oh, full of bricks. I'm so disappointed in myself. <laughs> I mean, we dealt with it. We dealt with it. So there's no longer an issue. But... You know, there's also no longer anyone. I mean, look at look at all the stuff that the game has set up for you so you can sneak around and like take people out quietly. And I've gone ahead and sort of discounted that and shot everyone in a bathroom. <laughs> I'm still in a bit of disbelief, to be honest. All right, we'll keep looking around and um, I'll play for five more minutes and then I have to cut this. Uh, but I can't believe that. Alright, well I think we've got everything that's here. Yeah, pretty much. Okay. Alright, let's go upstairs and then I'll call this quits. I'll call this clusterfuck of mistakes. Quits. Hey, it looks like there's a ladder inside this elevator. Hold up, let me try to open it. Let me make sure we go for first. Alright. Yeah, I know. I get it. I know, you've, you've seen what I've done, and you've realised I'm a bit of an idiot, but... We'll open it. Give me a second, I'm just going to make a health kit, because I know I'm going to need it. <laughs> Should we make another... No, it can't. Let's see where this goes. Oh, God. Okay. Just in case. That looks yeah. like a way through. You it's gonna be a tight fit, but that. come on. Okay. Oh, God. Heights. Okay. Gently. <laughs> you find me some right. climb on. Here we go. There you go. Please be careful. <laughs> I've already proved that I've been pretty incredibly lucky at the same time, bollocks! And then, okay, this is where I'm gonna call it quits. Thank you very much, guys. Love you to bits. Um, right. Hopefully, I'll do better next part. <laughs> I mean, we survived, but it was just a calamity. It was an absolute calamity. All right, love you to bits. I had fun. All right, just to emphasize, I had a shit ton of fun there. All right, love you to bits. Au revoir. See you later. Face bump.